your host today, Gary, and my channel represents wisdom for men and women. I also make music videos to entertain men and women. So if you're interested in music, click up on the playlist and you will see it under music videos. However, let's get into it. Today we're going to be talking about why do women get one night stand? Think about that for a second. If you're a woman out there and you got one night stand and the guy's completely just ghost you and completely lost all contact with you immediately after you guys had sex. No phone calls, you call them, no nothing. Why do you think that is? Think about it for a second. Well, one of the things is that you get one night stand that I believe, in my opinion, is because the guy wasn't interested in you other than the one night stand. That's, that's what he looked at you as, a one night stand, and that was that. That's, that could be possible. Because a lot of guys out there, they, they, they can be really attractive to a woman and they have urges. Like, I got to get this woman. 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 I'm craving this woman. I'm craving this woman for their own pleasure. For their own pleasure. That could be that. That's number one. Number two, it could be because your hygiene. It could be because of your hygiene. Now, I know we all work, you know, at least most of us, we all got jobs, we all work, we go to school, we go to the gym, and sometimes some, sometimes we slack, not all of us, but sometimes we slack when it comes to hygiene. And I'm here to tell you that that can be a possible thing for you women out there, for guys to sit there and lose all contact with you. It could be your hygiene. You're not as clean as you think you are, possibly. And this is just my opinion. So. I would recommend before you see a guy, make sure your underwear is clean, make sure your pants is clean, make sure your house don't have no odors, make sure, like, even if you've got a family member to say, hey, you know what, look, like, you know, um, look, can you, like, you know, am I good? Am, am, I, am I straight? You know, you can, you, you can have perfume on, just make sure that you're absolutely clean. I don't give a darn if you gotta go to the, the laundromat and make sure you wash all your clothes out. If you got a cat or a dog, that smell can get on you. That smell can get on you, you know, or it can be hot outside. It can be hot in the environment you're in. You might start sweating. You have to take care of that. It helps out a lot. Or you cannot be shaved down there. Shaving, in my opinion, is really good because if somebody wants to put their face down there, you want to make sure it's nice and clean. If, some, if somebody wants to wants to go down there and, and, and penetrate, you want to make sure it's nice and clean and nice and groomed. It's just like a... It's just like a meal. You want you to make sure your meal is nice and edible, is nice and clean. You don't want to make it look like it, it's been in a dumpster. You don't want nothing like that. You want something that's clean. You don't want nothing that's mildewed and rotten. You want to look at your body like an actual decent meal that you actually eat. Not nothing disgusting with a whole bunch of flies on it. You know? So that's how you want to look at that stuff. It's very important. So... That's the two things that I think why women get one night stand. The guy just have an urge. He's not into you other than his urge. And number two, it could be a possible hygiene. So if you correct those things, if you correct those things, I believe that, you know, your results can actually change. So if you think my video is of value, Please hit the like and subscribe button. It helps out the channel. I put very hard work into this channel. And I love you all. If you guys want to have a conversation about this, please talk to me in the comment section. I respond back to all my comments. And whatever video you want me to touch up next about relationships and dating, whether you're a guy or a girl or whatever you want to call yourself, let me know in the comment section. I'm here to accommodate you with wisdom as possible, why I'm living on this earth. I love you all. Thank you for watching. Until next time on Gary's Wisdom. Bye-bye. Peace.